We're live at Newsom Stadium in Nashville, home of the Lycans, where country music started. Uh, a bit of trivia for you, Grim. Nashville has the lowest number of teeth per person. Whatever. And yeah, this is going to be a bloody game. The teams are loading their weapons and sharpening their spikes. The Hexon Oilers take on the Nashville Lycans. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> if the sound of a torn Achilles followed by laughter and taunting brings a smile to your face, you are tuned to the right place. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow and the NFL crew is coming to you live on game day. Bricks, any uh, thoughts on today's game? Um, I thought I had one, but uh, I think I might have forgotten it. Oh, I remember. Uh, I forgot who's playing today. Careful what you asked for, Grim. Oh, nice hit. Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. And it's first and ten. Oh, look at this guy, Brick. Man, oh man, he hit that line the way your wife hits the all you can eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her low intestines just exploded. No, that's a relief, because there's nothing worse than food poisoning. Ah, uh, you're telling me. continues to climb. They might catch him. Move, you fat little mutant. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. First and ten. And he's off to the races. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. Yep. He's coming out in the field now. First in and three. Oh, with a punishing hit, the quarterback goes down. <laughs> Second down and six. Try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? 
straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. And the quarterback drills one in for the bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays! Talk about luck! I don't think we can have it! First and ten. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So is that cheerleader. Second down and ten. When I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And it's first and ten. Oh. He may not be able to comprehend math. The ref that just called that penalty, he was convicted of marrying old ladies and stealing their savings. That sounds like a good job. He's right at home here, taking money from coaches, players, and fans. I even saw him swipe the money from the bathroom attendant. Yeah, who don't do that? And it's first and ten. Another pick. He should have eaten his. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. And it's first and ten. You can tell he's a berserker because he's frothing at the mouth. Oh, that guy? Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, I'm still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. Second down and two. Republican congressman hits the airport. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. And it's first and ten. Now I've had it. I'm running out of excuses. And there's a bone crusher right there, folks. First and ten. And he rumbles for nine on that play. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, man, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. And that'll bring a 
it's second and one. Second down and two. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. First and ten. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. And that'll be second and eight to go. Wrestles away from that tackle. He's not, and he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point and a well placed cleat. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> and it's first and ten. How you run the football? A pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it? It's anyone's game still at this point. I know, which makes it so hard to place a bat. Second and three. And he was stuck to him like glue. Third down and three. Wrestling? The ref calls a penalty. You know, the MFL has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book, and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties. Still by jerks. Yo guys suck. First down and five. like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. And that'll be second and eight to go. Oh, great catch! And that's a touchdown! Touchdown! Say what? Come on, man, you can't hang with me. Get my grill. I'm gonna ruin your world. You understand me? And here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Oh man, he really wants it. And it's first and ten. starting to soften. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check 
busting off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more! The offense is losing quarterbacks faster than teams lose their minds at spring break. They're down to their last QB before they have to forfeit. And it's first and ten. Oh, no, it's a sticky ball. The quarterback goes down. Zoom on his face. Boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and oh, he did some nasty things to dogs. Nestro Lichens were neutered today in a devastating loss by forfeit. Yeah, what's left of them is walking on the field with a tail between their legs. And that guy's carrying his tail. Oh, it got ripped off. It's probably a good thing the game ended up in forfeit. They weren't going to make it out of the stadium alive with this performance anyway. The fans were going to kill them if the opposition didn't. Gotta love that fan passion. Let's hear what the game's MVP has to say about this carnage. I'd rather listen to Sarah Balin read the entire works of Shakespeare while tripping my brains out. Uh, actually, that sounds kind of fun. Hey, man, nobody can touch you with eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Heart Corporation. Make it a right every...